This morning, big changes are in the works at the United States Postal Service. The pandemic amplified years of service problems and financial trouble. But during a heated hearing, the postmaster says that will change. For local mail, first class. Well, you need to define local. And uh, I don't know, for a second, I don't agree with any of your premise about my involvement. Uh, are you trying to suggest? The, you can take that up with the Washington Post. Contentious moments on Capitol Hill. Postmaster General Louis DeJoy, pressed by members of the House Oversight and Reform Committee Wednesday, unveiling part of his plan to turn the U.S. Postal Service around. A commitment to six and seven day a week delivery service to every address in the nation. We're investing in our network infrastructure including vehicles, technology, and package sortation equipment. But there may be bigger changes in the works. Sir, will you commit to keeping two-day delivery of first-class mail locally? I will, we, there will be two-day mail class in our plan. Uh, some percentage of that uh, where the reach is right now may change. DeJoy also offered up an apology for backed up deliveries during the 2020 holiday season. Too many Americans were left waiting for weeks for important deliveries of mail and packages. This is unacceptable and I apologize to those customers who felt the impact of our delays. And despite calls for his resignation, DeJoy says he has no plans to leave. How much longer are you planning to stay? A uh, long time. Get used to me. And President Biden has announced nominees to fill three of the four empty seats on the U.S. Postal Service's board. And that includes a former postmaster general who resigned under President Trump.